All right, so I actually found an AFK Inferno method that makes just about 40 mil a day, which, by the way, that 40 mil a day is with no minion upgrades besides a tier 5 beacon, and 7 of my 30 minions are tier 2, so there's a lot of room for improvement. Basically how it works is you get the same amount of minion drops, but you do not have to spend money on the crazy gabagool fuel for your minions, because um, with normal... Inferno minions, the Gabagool fuel costs a lot of money, which is, it costs like 90% of your profits or something crazy like that. So with this method, you could completely bypass that and use like Nether Ward or Glowstone uh, Distillate for your fuel, and it will work just the same. So ignore the AFK man up here, but this is the AFK Inferno setup. Now it looks pretty funky, I know, but it will probably make sense when you could go inside, so you could come up. And basically, the player isn't involved in the process, like, at all. What happens is the minion kills the Inferno, and you pick up the drop. It's that simple. Now, um, getting the design down is a little bit hard, because if you don't have it perfectly right, the Infernos will spawn in the other, like, areas which will just straight up cause problems because the minion won't be able to reach them anymore. Really weird glitch, but yeah, it works pretty well. Now, like I said a minute ago, my setup makes um, 40 mil a day, and that's AFKing for just about 22 hours a day. It makes 40 mil. Um, the most AFK coverage you can get, the better, but let me just go over some weird kind of things that you need to know about this setup. So, one, if the minions fill up, you need to collect them because they won't be spawning infernos anymore. Um, if they're not spawning and killing infernos, you aren't getting any money, so make sure your minions are empty. Also, you cannot use minion expanders with this setup. I am a big advocate for minion expanders, but basically it will mess up the, like the minions range or something. It's kind of weird and pretty goofy, but you should just keep that in mind when you are building this. And lastly, if I go back up into here, um, sometimes Infernos will like, um, if you don't have the setup perfectly, um, they will shoot at you. And if there is fire anywhere, if there's, okay, if there's fire on the floor, uh, some of the Gabagool will get burned. And if there's fire up here, the minions just won't spawn the Infernos anymore. So very much keep that in mind. So I'm just gonna show you all how to make it real quick. Let me get some blocks. Okay, so you're gonna wanna make a five by five area, kind of like this. Then you're gonna wanna get some fences and put fences up. Uh, personally, I prefer just putting fences up like this. I didn't do that in my current design, but I think it will be more efficient and you do this for all four sides, so like this. You go up um, pretty tall with that. Uh, you should stop, so you should probably cover the roof here. So we can just make a quick and easy roof here. Now you're just gonna kinda wanna fill up the rest of the area, so put some oak plant, like put some blocks in the corners here and then just build a wall on every single side. This will prevent infernos from really spawning in the wrong places. So this is basically the making the setup is probably the hardest part about this, but once you do it, it, it will work very well. Okay, once you do that, um, definitely have it in the air like that setup, but I just came over here to make this thing quick. Uh, you want to break a block down here, and the infernos are going to be spawning here, so the bottom is kind of your entry area. So you're going to break these blocks here, usually, and just put slabs. Um, just because I, I feel like it works better for whatever reason. Now, just think of the oak fence as the minions. You're going to want to place the minions in like a 9x9 nine nine area on the wall. So kind of like this. And also, be very sure... Um, 
basically what can happen is the minions, so here's an example. Oh, storage just filled up on these guys, but this guy right here can't reach any blazes, so he he just won't be working. So you can horribly limit your efficiency in act like accidentally by um, not having your minions in the right places. If you just have a dude that like I can't reach any of my minions, just pick him up, move him, place him down somewhere else. I'm gonna move this guy like here. Put some fuel into him, and yeah, he should work just fine now. Now, to really make this thing work, what you do, or how to AFK in it, you kind of just go up into the area, and you literally just stand here. Now, you do need a booster cookie, and you do need a magnetic talisman, okay? So, or magnetic talisman. Increases the item pickup range by three. Um, if you don't have this, you'll be like missing out on a lot of like pickups and also as you saw here you need a bunch of slayer sacks personally i haven't even gotten all the slayer sacks i need but um if you're going to be afking for a long time for like i think it's more than nine hours you need more sa you need more sacks than 22 but yeah just get a bunch of slayer sacks they will help you tremendously so this setup makes just about 40 million coins a day which it's a very unoptimized minions setup, so the minions aren't good and it's still making me 40 mil. I believe if you got like full tier three mithril infused, you should you could be making upwards of like 50 million coins a day, which that's a lot of money AFK. Also, remember, um, remember, remember, remember that you need those slayer sacks because once your inventory fills up, then the Minions inventories will fill up and you lose a lot of profit there and try to be on AFK as much as possible um, Yeah, just uh, Listen to everything I said in the video and if you have any questions you can go ahead drop them in the comment section I'll try to reply to them. You can visit me at uh, Duckzilla444 So Duckzilla444 and also you can uh, join my discord and ask the community questions there uh, there's like 350 people in it which is crazy so yeah you should join that and have a great day uh, also um, for the people who saw yesterday's video sorry about that um, it was about normal inferno minions I did the math wrong and my brain was like eh, I just won't take it down and then um, yeah a lot of people disliked it and stuff so I took it down um, yeah, sorry for, uh, quality control there, but I, I was kind of tired yesterday, so I was like, eh, I'll just leave it up. So, yeah, have a great day, and I will see you later. I am out of here.